Wow, you look amazing. Don't start. Why? Oh, I just gave you a compliment. You... I'm going to set some ground rules. Okay. I'm going to Luke and Lars' wedding with Jax, as in on his arm. Uh-huh. We're in love, as in planning a wedding. You're not allowed to cause any trouble. You should pick that one. You know what's funny? Mm hmm Even when you're trying to keep your distance, it's just, you, you can't resist getting all wifey on me. So why are you even going to this wedding? Because he's an alibi. That's why. Where's Sam? Uh, she's at the safe house. She's fine. He needs an alibi because he's made arrangements for us to turn ourselves in. Okay. All right. Well, whatever you guys think is best. All right. You be careful, please. Okay. And you remember the rules? How's uh, Alex's old computer genius? The son's annoying. Yeah, he is a freak. But, you know, he's the only proof we have that Alcazar and, and Rick teamed up for the frame. As soon as you take him and Sam to the PCPD, there's going to be a car waiting for you in the alley. You know how many ways this can go wrong. The serious Jones for barbecue chips and all your weird boyfriend keeps around her crackers. Hey, How listen, lame is that? Listen to me. Once we turn ourselves in, the DA has 48 hours they can hold us. Are you sure you're up for that? I'd do better if I were fortified by some decent snackage. Eat the crackers. Take them. They're good for you. I'm gonna go freshen up. Uh, back scrubbing is one of my many hidden talents. <laughs> <laughs> Try it and I'll break your hand. Ever told you that your interests are limited? I'm young. You Don't want to spread myself too thin. <laughs> Don't know. <laughs> Urban onslaught too awesome. Okay. Yeah. You like that? Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, good. I want you to have fun. Look, he's not a bad kid. Do we have to lock him in the bathroom? I just, I just wanted to be alone with you. Okay? We need to make the most of whatever time we have left. <sighs> okay. We've been together for two years, mm -hmm. and I never knew you could cook. Well, I'm not an expert, but I had to find my way around the kitchen so I wouldn't starve to death. So all those times that I burned water and brought home takeout and you just let me, you never told me that you could cook because what? Why? What? You didn't want to show me up? I don't really care if you can't cook. spotted Spinelli at a convenience store and followed him. You found Sam and Jason? Are you okay? Yeah, I just think we're taking a big risk. Turning ourselves in, it can blow up in our faces. Now all we have to do is watch the place and take them out the second they leave. You're really worried about tonight, aren't you? Well, let me be the one to reassure you for a change. We are okay. Hey! Starter in here! And the nose knows you two are grubbing! Alright, let him out. It's almost time to go. Okay! Okay! Whoa! 
Since when are we packing heat? Ah, uh, dude, there's no we. <laughs> the hotness quotient just went even higher. <laughs> then again, dude, this could be suicide. I thought we were going to surrender peacefully. We're going to give up the weapons once we're safely in custody. We can define safely. This is going to work. You just have to trust us. What, am I not to argue when you're armed and dangerous? I mean, look, love doesn't always triumph. We're here on official business. It seems Sam and Jason didn't surrender themselves as previously agreed. That would make them fugitives still. And now, you are officially an accessory. You want to arrest him, please? You know something we don't, Rick. Like they didn't make it because you set up an ambush. Is that what happened? Get out. Get out of the car. General Hospital.